it is a very personal thing for people to let a designer come into their home. Interior design is very much a helping industry where you're helping people and you're looking out for people's needs and the requirements of, of young people to people aging. Well, people let you into their lives by sitting down and having hours upon hours of meetings determining what kind of bathtub they want, what kind of a, a style that they're looking for, what their hopes and dreams are. I will help people with paint color or window coverings. I will help an architect and the homeowner design from ground up to furnishing a place and just working on renovating a kitchen or a bathroom. Oftentimes husbands and wives have different ideas on things so I often find myself being a little bit of a mediator between and determining you know what's going to make them happy, what's going to work for them in the long run. I would tell a young person to take the introductory course at BCIT which is fantastic to give you an overview of what is involved in, in design because it's incredibly diverse as well as work in a furniture store or somewhere where they can get some hands-on experience working with customers and working with um, fabrics and things like that to see what interests them. The flexibility that this job has given me over the years raising my two kids, which I'm crazy about, um, it's, it's been perfect. There's always something to learn. There's something to learn about fireplaces, fireboxes, and how a gas fireplace works, and how to vent it, and there's constantly something, or a challenge for every job site, of how to make it work.